So in this video, I want to talk about what I think are the top five best applications I think everybody should have installed on their device. Say if you're brand new to this, you just got an Android TV box. This is my top five recommendations for what I think is all you really need when it comes to movies, TV shows, live TV, sports, pretty much anything. Let's be honest, how many of you really use all of the add-ons in whatever build you're using? Me, personally, I only use about three add-ons total, and that's it. And I only use about two Android applications. So, you don't really need all of these add-ons and all these applications that some of these YouTubers keep posting every single day. I mean, it's good and all because I do believe in having like choices and stuff like that. These five are something that are going to last you and pretty much all you need. I'm going to start it off. Obviously, the first one being Kodi or SPMC. SPMC is just a fork of Kodi. I think it runs better on Android devices. First thing you need to do is obviously install Kodi. You can get it from the Google Play Store or you can download it from their website. I'll have um, the link in the description of this video to where you guys can go and download all of these applications that I'm about to show you in the video first thing is Cody download that put a build on it if you want to if you want to put this build on my build that you see right now I'll link to it in the description for you guys so you can check it out the next application I think everybody should have is terrarium TV this application is free and you will need MX player to use this application, but you can get MX player in the Play Store for free. So don't worry about that. Terrarium TV has movies and TV shows. Right now I'm in TV shows under trending. And as you can see, it is just a huge list of movies and TV shows. Believe it or not, I do get sick of Cody with the amount of time I spend on it doing videos, builds, updating builds. Sometimes I just really get sick of looking at Cody, so I'll switch to Terrarium TV and watch movies and TV shows from this. But a pretty big list, and you will need MX Player, like I said, in order to play the videos. So I'll just give you an example. We'll do The Walking Dead, and uh, we'll pick Season 1. And it kind of brings up something like Exodus, Zen, and Specto, where it's got a list of providers that you can pick from. So we'll just do this first episode right here. You just go up here, you click play. And now it's going to bring up a list of providers similar to Exodus, Zen, and Specto, as you can see right here. Um, I always try to go for Watch 5S. If this ever shows up for you, definitely pick this one first. I've never had issues with it. So you just click on it and you click play and it's going to open up MX Player for you. And then it's going to start playing the TV show or movie of your choice. So there it is. As you can see, it starts playing. I'm going to stop it though. And then you just go back. But that's how you play videos and or movies and TV shows in Terrarium TV. So that is probably my second favorite application aside from Cody itself. And then the next application I think everybody should have is the famous Mobdro. This is good for, it's another free application, and it's good for live TV, sports, so you get channels, news, shows, movies, sports. Um, you can click on channels. It's got a bunch of the popular channels that you would get normally with Comcast, DirecTV, or whatever, AMC, A&E, ABC. A lot of popular stuff in there, and you can also get sports. So this is another one that I recommend. Moving on in the list, I do recommend having a VPN. This is very important now, guys, especially with the vote that just happened a few days ago with Congress, selling all of your information. It's good to have a VPN. I don't, I really don't care what VPN you use. Just don't use a free VPN. If you want to check out the VPN that I use, this one, I will link to it in the description. But make sure you have a VPN and make sure you're always connected to it before you start streaming anywhere, whether it be Kodi, Movie Sites, Terrarium TV, Mobdro. Make sure you're connected to a VPN. 
And I think that about sums it up for the top five because I'm including MX player in there with Terrarium TV. So those are my top five recommendations for applications I think everybody should have. Cody, SPMC, Terrarium TV, MX player, Mobdro, and then a good VPN. You install those five things on your device and I'm pretty sure you're going to be set with movies, TV shows, sports, live TV. It's pretty much all you really need and all of these applications are free minus the VPN. You want to get a good paid VPN. So I'll have a link in the description to where you guys can go and download these applications. I highly suggest you guys put it on your device if you don't have these on there already. And between the five of them, you guys really should be set for stuff to watch. So I hope this video helped. And until then, I will see you guys in my next video. See ya!